Welcome to this short tutorial video on issuing clearances with IVAC2 from Terminal 2 Solutions. To issue a departure clearance, use the DCL menu. The call sign and destination airport are filled in from the flight plan. You can see the full flight plan if you wish. The runway in use has been calculated based on the ATIS, but you can change it here if you need to. The SID identifier is calculated from data inside the FIR definitions. Transitions are not supported in the current version of IVAC2. The squawk code is entered here manually, but in future versions will be calculated automatically. The next frequency would usually be yourself, but if you're a delivery controller and want to advise the pilot to contact ground or tower, then you would enter it here. The clearance can be automatically sent as a com controller pilot data link. If you wish to send it that way, use send DCL. If you're going to relay the clearance by voice, then click voice, and no CPDLC will be transmitted. Notice that the tags have been updated to show the Samba 1 Yankee departure and the initial altitude of 5,000 feet. Thanks for watching.